Hi everyone, this is Dr. Kim, America's Holistic Foot Doctor. In this video, you meet my patient who has developed a deep-seated corn on her pinky toe. She has developed this because her foot is kind of deviated like this and then the little toe is rubbing against the shoe. Let's see how deep this corn is. Shoe or the floor. Yeah, so I'm gonna clean this up. I'm gonna do the rest of the nails and I'm gonna get this nail really thin because that's, that's what the pain is, okay? So let me work on that corn a little bit. Have we burnt this before? No. No? Okay, we may have to burn this one if it's painful, okay? After I do this, if it's still painful, then I may have to burn it so to completely get rid of it. So it's not painful anymore. But you can see that this thing is quite deep in there, as you can see. There's a round circle in there. We call it, we call it corn. The calluses are painful too, but the corns are really painful. It feels like there's a little rock sitting inside. As you can see, there's, there's a round circle in the middle. The only way we can get rid of this is to burn it off. And then when we burn it, then, then the whole thing comes off from underneath. So that's, that's what we need to do. Let's get it. Okay. Is she up to getting this burnt? Mom, a lo mejor le van a tener que quemar allí porque no es callus, no es, es otra cosa. No sé cómo se llama, pero es como una piedra que tiene adentro. A lo mejor se lo van a tener yeah. que quemar. Yeah, as you can see, there's a, a lo mejor, se lo van a tener que there's quemar. There's a corn in there. Uh, it's not going to hurt when I do it, but it may be hurting the next few days. So you have to kind of take it easy on it, but... It's not urgent unless you have a lot of pain. We don't have to burn it. I can just keep doing this whenever you come in. As you can see, there's a round circle inside there. I'm gonna try to go a little deeper and take some more of those out. As you can see, you see that round circle in there. That's the, that's the corn. And I'm gonna grind this down really good so that it's not gonna be a problem. Sometimes I have to take this nail out if, um, this grinding is not enough. As you can see, I can take quite a bit of this corn out without hurting her, but if you wanna get rid of it permanently, I have, to, I have to burn it. And then the root would come out and then hopefully it won't come back. It usually don't come back, so. As you can see, it's pretty deep there. Can I explain to her, doctor? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mom, that dice que para que se es no se mueva mucho para que se le quite eso lo tienen que quemar no le duele cuando lo estén quemando va a estar le va a doler pasado mañana y mañana pero ahorita no le duele pero es como una bolita y le queman para que le tiene que quitar la raíz o oh. ajá pero si usted quiere no le hace eso pero si quiere oh. que se lo queme para que le quite la raíz si sí le va a doler mañana y pasado tiene que estar sin hacer nada pues I can see, put, this is pretty deep. If I do any more, she's going to be bleeding, so. So you think it's better to burn it? Um, yeah, after we, after I finish. Hi, it's me again. Hope you've been enjoying this video so far. If you have, leave the word pinky corn in the comments below, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's more permanent than uh, just, uh, you know, uh -huh. cleaning this, it out. This so. is the second time. <laughs> for her anymore, but if it continues, then I have to take this nail out and start new because this nail is kind of really thick here. A lot of these nails get thick and they're not necessarily fungus. They're just um, irritated nail that become uh, thick and just like callus of the skin, the nail can become uh, thick. We call them onychobrycosis, which means the thickening or enlargement of the nail. Sometimes these are not necessarily fungus, so you can't even treat it on a, on a, other than keeping it down and, you know, kind of the pressure off of it. Because when there's pressure, nail also get thicker and grow as well, just like the like skin. So, okay. Is that better, Bernice?
Yeah. yeah. So it's just it pretty good with it. It feels a little bit jumpy, so it's more painful earlier. So I think this may do it for a while and then it's just a problem then we have to either burn the cones or uh, just remove the nail and start new. And sometimes that comes out more normal than what it is. As you can see, it's uh, much more thin now and it's a lot better. So let's see. Is that hurting, Panit? No. No? Okay. So, he's pretty tough. So, so, I got it down pretty good. As you can see, the corn's been cleaned out, and then the nails been kind of thinned out. So, hopefully, this will take up at least for a while, and then let's see if we need to do anything further in the future. Okay? So, Thank you for watching this video. As you can see in this video, pressure against the shoe can cause a deep corn and a thick nail. They developed the protected area, but it ended up becoming too thick and too painful. Until then, be educated, get empowered, encourage others today.